Now, across the country, as Ed mentioned, we've had a national ceremony. We've had regional ceremonies across the country. And today, it's my honor to present the Congressional Gold Medal to two recipients. The first is Ray Chan. Now, my father was a pilot in World War II in the China Burma India Theater, and he flew 500 missions across the hump. Uh, Ray Chan flew missions across the hump. And so I'm particularly honored to present the Congressional Gold Medal to Ray Chan for his service. And thank you for your service and congratulations to you on this award. And so uh, Ray, uh, you're out there. Uh, if you'd like to say a few words, or with the uh, help of the family, if any of the family would like to say a few words initially. I would like to say that I, uh, I feel extremely fortunate to be sitting here beside my father, Raymond Chan, a veteran who served the USA with pride during World War II. And on his behalf, as well as on behalf of his wonderful wife, my mother, Ida Chan, flanked by my husband, Terry Yang, and by my elder sister, Barbara Chan, who is here in the virtual audience. In addition, my, our younger brother, our late younger brother, Raymond Scott Chan, who was a World War II buff and encouraged our father to tell stories from his time in the military. And on behalf of the whole Raymond Chan family, I really wish to sincerely thank you, Major General Bill Chan, for your service to our nation and for bestowing upon my father this very, very precious congressional gold medal. And I wish to express heartfelt uh, in the admiration and sincerity appreciation to Mr. Ed Gore for the thousands and thousands of hours that you and other members of the Chinese American World War II Veterans National Project and the Chinese American Citizens Alliance have done, have invested in really advocating for the Chinese American World War II Veterans Congressional Gold Medal Act for educating the public about the efforts and accomplishments of Chinese Americans who have served the United States and for preserving this legacy. For all of this, we sincerely owe you immense gratitude. Thank OK, you. thank you, Marsha. We'll have more opportunity later for other family members who might want to speak. 